Right, take your lunch now and after routine bloods. Sorry, I'm just going to ignore that. Excuse me? Patronising all the whole family. I don't see how it's patronising. Look, I'm the one here on the ward. I have a lot to offer him. I've passed my exams and I'm ready to give this my all. I can't be in contact with this family. Can you trust me to pass an information without breathing down the neck? If I shut you down, I'm sorry, but you do realise what you said. You broke rule number one. You promised them their kid would survive the op. Which I have every confidence you No, it's not your place to second guess that. Now, if she doesn't make it out of theatre, it's a betrayal of trust. And trust me, you don't want to be the one breaking that news. I just want to give them hope. How long have you been here? Six weeks, what? I get it. You want to prove yourself. You want to treat every patient and family with 100% optimism. But when you've worked here for this long in paediatrics, seen what I've seen, you err on the side of caution. Surely that's just too realistic. No! It's realistic. It's life. It's about me and the rest. I'll pull up from your day. They said you blame yourself. You're the hardest work on this ward. There wouldn't have been anything else you could have done. But I won't do it again. Don't mind me off just yet, okay? 